Hello and welcome to this Good Webs tutorial. I'm Sean Kushner. This tutorial will show you how to create a filter that will let you track the page rank of keywords people use to find your website. What are keywords? Keywords are the words or phrases that people type into the Google search box to find something they're looking for. If a user is looking for new tires, he might type in lowest price tires DC. You can see from the search that there are over 5 million displayed results for our search for the lowest price tires. The search results are displayed instantaneously and are based on what Google believes are the most relevant websites to our search terms. Keep in mind that most people never leave the first page. That's why it's extremely important to not only know the keywords people use to find our website, but to also know the page rank for those keywords. Here you can see a keyword report that shows a long list of keywords and a number of different marketing metrics. There's a lot of useful information here to help you improve your website, but it's missing something important. This keyword report is missing the page rank of the individual keywords. Wouldn't it be important to know how your website compares to the competition? This is a custom report that uses the search engine results page rankings filter. You can see that every keyword also has its page rank listed. Notice that the top column header does not say keyword, but instead shows the term user defined value. If you look closely, you can tell that user defined value has two parts, the keyword and in parentheses, the word position and a number. That number is the page rank of the keyword on the search engine results page. Go into your Google Analytics account. You're going to want to click the admin button. Then once you're there, you'll want to hit the filters tab. You're going to create a new filter by hitting plus new filter. And now it's time to create the filter. We're going to name this search engine results pages rankings or SERPs rankings. We'll make it a filter type of custom and advanced. For field A, we're going to put in campaign term. And that's just simply a dot star, which means grab everything. For field B, we're going to call that referral and it's a long regular expression so we'll just cut and paste that from the blog. Finally, for the user defined value, we're going to cut and paste that one as well and that one will be A1 position B2 which is simply keyword position whatever the page rank is. Finally, We'll set field A, field B, and override to yes, which means we require those, and we don't care that it's case sensitive, so we can leave that at no. Save it. Congratulations, you've created a search engine results page rankings filter.